Hello everyone, it's your boy Vixterity XD, and welcome to race 2 of the uh, Season 6 Monster Energy Cup Sim Racing Series Season. Season 6, race 2. We are at Kansas Motor Speedway. Here we have a uh, Bushy Bushy or Kyle Bush parked outside because he's a contender. And therefore, he gets automatic uh, uh, spot in the chase, so therefore, he doesn't need to race anymore until the chase begins. So, this race is going to be 30 laps, and we're going to be pitting at laps uh, 11 through 12 and 24 through 25. Also, you see that green number 8? That's not Vixterity anymore. That's uh, Daniel Hemrick, who's driving the number 8 car part-time for Richard Childress Racing, which I hope he will, he will go there full-time. I really hope so. I've already heard riot, riots and outcries about Hemrick not going to the 27. So, um, uh... So, Richard Childress Racing, you better give him a full-time ride in the 8 next year. Please. Alright. Let's go racing again at Kansas. To start things off, we have Martin Truex Jr. leading the way. Danica Patrick right behind. Up here comes Greg Golden to the inside. Let's see what he can do. Nothing. Brad Kislaska to the inside. He takes the lead. Oh, and Jeffrey Earnhardt in the double zero. Way inside. Let's see what he does. Up, oh, DJ Kennington goes to the outside and takes the lead. But Ryan Ellis and Corey LaJoy. LaJoy all the way to the inside. He steals the lead from Kennington and denies him to lead that lap. Corey LaJoy is a big advantage over Ryan Ellis. I, I mean, oh my god, I thought that was Ryan Ellis, I swear to god. That was Alex Bowman. LaJoy continues to extend his lead. But here comes Daryl Wallace Jr. Gaining up time. That big lead can vaporize in one lap. And it does. Brad Kozlowski reclaims the lead. Oh, but Court LaJoy tries to go, tries to cross him over, but he doesn't. Danica Patrick in the seven car, moving up fast. Lap 9. That's Corey LaJoy and Kurt Busch fighting for the lead. DJ Kennington advances to third. One more lap before Pitts. Danica Patrick's running up there. And she moves into second behind DJ Kennington. But not for long as Kennington reclaims the lead. I'm... Pit road's open now. Look at everyone coming in. Wow, Chase Sally, a big run into pit road. He swooped all the way down the track and went into pit road. Oh, Timmy Hill is not having a good day in that 51. He's in the back. I forgot to put 12, so now it's lap 13. Chase Elliott, Kurt Busch, Joey Logano all fighting for the lead with Bubba Wallace Jr. behind to challenge. But it doesn't seem to be working as Chase Elliott and Joey Logano continue to try to advance their lead. 
Here comes Logano to the inside. Logano takes the lead. But Danica Patrick and DJ Kennington are coming back. Here comes Greg Golding to the inside. Oh, and Danica Patrick loses out on second place as Greg Golding swoops down to the inside to reclaim the position. Here goes Wolfie Three Wide for the lead. Golding. Danica Patrick used Greg Golding as a pick, and great. And Danica Patrick is in the lead right now. Danica Patrick is in the lead. Up, oh, not for long. Greg Golding takes it back. And that unsponsored 23. The fans want to see Danica Patrick win. It would be big for us and it would, it would be big for the company. But here comes Joe Logano and he's bringing a new face on board. David Gilliland in that 92. Now it's a four car parade at, up front. But Gilliland seems to be extending his lead. This could, uh, him getting a lead, this is foreshadowing something that he may lose out in the end. You see, everyone, every time someone gets a big lead, the, the, the guys, they start to get, go fast and gang up on him. And here's Jimmy Johnson. Up, oh, Derek Hope, the 99, is coming along with him too, and so is Chase Elliott. Chess Elliott gets blocked by David Gilliland. But they're still hanging on. Chase Elliott grasping on to David Gilliland. It's a two-car battle for the lead. Patrick is falling back. She's fading from the lead. She can't be doing this. I want to see her win. Though I'm not supposed to be biased on drivers, but it would be nice if she won. Chase Elliott is in the lead. D David Gilliland behind him. Pit Road is open. Chase Elliott. David Gilliland. And a whole bunch of other hungry racers looking for the win. Who will win and who will lose? That's the question that will be answered within these next five laps. I mean, these last five laps. Chase Selly in the lead. But here comes Danica Patrick back into the top five. Him and Trevor Bain are working together to go to the lead. But Chase Selly is not, is not going to give up that lead. Chase Elliott still has a big lead, but Trevor Bain's trying to track him down. But he's running out of time. Chase Elliott extends his lead. Will this be a big win for him or a big choke? Two laps remaining. White flag. Final lap. Chase Elliott is leading right now. He is pulled away from Jimmy Johnson and Trevor Bain. And it's just enough. Chase Elliott. A new number. A new face. Chase Elliott wins at Kansas. Johnson second. Bain third. Blaney fourth. And Dick Gilliland fifth. Well, well. Nice try, everyone. But Chase Elliott... Wins yet again. His third win in the Sim Racing Series. But it's not enough to catch Ryan Ellis yet. Who has five, I think. But it's okay. Chase Elliott is going to the chase. <laughs> chase is going to the chase. Or the playoffs. That's all, folks. 
and we'll see you in the next race. Oh, psych! Um, I forgot to say Happy Pat St. Patrick's Day a couple days ago. And also, thank you for 40,000 channel views. It, it means a lot to me, and we're growing as a small channel, and uh, let's see if we can reach 50,000, and then 100,000, and then so on, and so on. Yep, that's all, folks. We'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.